As Jackson looks to reopen, there are new restrictions on other parts of the state as the number of cases approaches 10,000. First, the numbers. The state health department reported 234 new cases, the total now over 9,900. There were 22 new reported deaths, and as seven Mississippi counties see a significant increase in cases, the governor is taking action. 12 News senior political correspondent Gerald Harris is live with the story. Hello, Gerald. Yeah, Mississippi is continuing to open, but seven counties will face stricter reopening guidelines from Atala, Leak, Scott, Jasper, Neshoba, Newton, and Lauderdale counties. They were identified as localized regions at a higher risk for transmission. Some of these counties have food processing plants. Um, not only are they in, in regions that have, say, for instance, a significant number of uh, meat processing facilities, a significant number of long-term care facilities, but also just their per capita numbers are so much larger uh, than virtually anywhere else in the state. Under new guidelines, all businesses must follow CDC and MSDH guidelines. Employees must be screened daily. Masks must be worn and social distancing must be done if possible. And hand sanitizer must be provided. Similarly, for retail businesses in those areas, all customers must wear a mask and or face covering and have hand sanitizer available. Now, as for the people just outside and about, you must wear a mask or a face covering and you also must maintain a six feet social distancing. Reporting in downtown Jackson, Gerald Harris, 12 News.